Hi guys, my name is Katie or Kibi Does Art and today we're going to be texturing our pizza box. This one should be pretty simple since um, I'm not really planning on doing a lot with it. Um, there is something kind of cool I want to try, but we'll see. It's kind of up to you how you want to texture it. So um, I think first things first, I want to just make the whole thing white. So hold right click, assign a new material. AI standard surface and then just leave it white but up your roughness because I don't want it glossy and then I want to make the inside brown so let's go into face mode and start selecting the inside pieces so just click one hold tab and then double click the next one to get oh don't select those though Ooh. okay for these you'll just have to like Hold tab and click and drag to get those guys. Here we go. All right, and then let's also do the top. And then just hold tab while you're selecting all of this so that you don't lose any because that would not be fun. Oh, accidentally got that one. Ooh. All right, and then uh, you can just like hold control and click the ones that you accidentally grabbed or you can hold tab and drag as well to deselect oh wait i want those yeah select those make sure i didn't miss any those guys those guys any on the upper okay there we go so we've got the inside all selected i'm gonna make this part brown so hold right click assign a new material do shader ai standard surface and then we'll just like find a brown color to make it um it's usually like that really warm orangey tone like that yeah all right and then i want to try something out oh um scroll on over here and up the roughness on that paper one the brown texture um, I love the pizza boxes where it does like cool checkered patterns. I think that's so fun. So, um, I'm just going to select this like checkered, then do assign a new material, AI standard surface, and then I want to make it like a red, like a fun light. Yes. <laughs> okay, sweet. Go ahead and, um, Click on poly modeling and grab a plane, scale it on up, click W and push it under so they're not interacting with each other. And then click on Arnold, grab a sky dome light and that should be good. Let's click on Arnold and render it out. I want to grab that ring in there and texture it brown so i'm just going to select those real quick and assign an existing material and then pick whatever brown color that was so it blends in all right you can see how the box is turning out here oh the little checker top is so fun I'm going to change the texture on that to be more rough, though, since you don't want it reflective. Ooh, if you click on the plane and then do assign new material and grab AI standard surface, and then when you click on this little checker box, grab the checker texture, you can see how your textures are playing off with the floor. All right, um, that's about it for this uh, texturing tutorial. If you guys have any questions, uh, let me know. But that is about it. So I will see you guys next time. Bye, guys.